Coach Owen. Welcome to today's London New Row Row Fit Circuit. Today we're going to go for a quick, tough workout, doing five exercises, three sets of that, so 15 in total. Should be good, should be hard work. So we're going to get straight into a warm up, so just nice and light jogging on the spot. It's nice and soft on your toes, nice and relaxed. Just going to slowly build your heart rate up. And then we're going to bring some arms in, start warming up those shoulders. And then just kick in behind. Just keep it nice and light on your feet. And then high knees. Keep that abdomen nice and tight, shoulders back, chest up. Then just bring that back down. Just going to go back into the shoulders. The arms, and then forwards, and just coming across again, making sure getting nice and warm, ready to do some hard work. Session will take us just under 20 minutes. Got about 15 minutes of the exercises plus a warm up and a cool down. Up above your head and down. And we're just going to build in a little squat with this. Going it down and up. Nice and controlled. Just little movements to start with. And back across the body. Keep the legs moving. Then we'll go back just to jogging on the spot. Then from this, we're going to go into some rotations. So just standing still, keep your hips still, rotating your shoulders, loosening up the back. Okay, and then some little lunges out to each side, just a small little movement, step it out. Not going to go too deep with this, just get in. Those hips warmed up and so ready to go. Okay, just last swing with the arms. Exercises we're going to do today press ups, squats, Russian twists, mountain climbers, and lunges. A nice all over body workout should get a little bit of everything. If you find doing the exercises really tough, I'll talk you for an easier version. If you find them easier, just try and go a little bit harder. And for some of them, I might show you some harder examples as well. So we don't want to hang around, let's get straight into this. 45 seconds of work, 15 seconds of rest, straight through, it's going to be tough. Grab a drinks bottle if you need it, if you've got one. We'll get ready to go. First exercise, press ups. So we're starting on the mat. Just make sure you've got enough room. I'll just start the countdown timer and we'll get going. Okay, straight into press ups, let's go. The nice straight back, coming down, arms back at 45 degrees. Nice and controlled. Don't knock your elbows out of the top, keep your arms very slightly bent. Abs in nice and tight. That's too hard, drop your knees. Keeping that nice straight line all the way up from your feet, from your knees, through your hips to your shoulders. Keep that head nice and relaxed, shoulders back. We're nearly there now. Coming into the last 10 seconds. Nice controlled breathing. Couple more reps. Go for two more. And done. Good work. So, squats next. Do shoulder width apart. As deep as you can, aiming for about 90 degrees. Nice controlled movement. Don't rush this first set. Get down and up. Again, 
Don't overextend the knees at the top. Hands either across, down, doesn't matter. Whatever's comfortable for you. My knees stay behind my toes. Back straight, chest up. Really think about engaging all those muscles in my legs. Getting everything working together. And one more. Good. Russian twists, really good for the core next. So, down on the mat. Looking for a nice C shape to our back. Keep our spine nice and strong. And we're for a rotating round. Looking to get elbows to knees. We want to make it a little bit harder. You can lean back a little bit more. You can rotate a little bit more. You can come up, make it closer if you want it to be easier. Just keep that breathing nice and controlled. 10 seconds to go. Just keep working hard. Don't want to stop early. Done. Mountain climbers, really good for getting the heart rate up. Also quite good for core. Press up position. Alternating knees coming in. Keep your elbows nice and relaxed. We'll start slowly. Back straight. My hands are staying below my shoulders. Shoulder blade squeezed in. Good, keep it going. Keep working. 10 seconds to go. Done. Good, into a lunge. Next, so we're gonna go lateral lunge side to side. Start in the middle, similar to we did in the warm up. A little bit deeper. Two, one, let's go. So just down and up. Again, keeping my knees over the middle of my feet. Chest up, back straight, shoulders back. Twenty seconds to go. Let's keep working. Nearly the first set done. So we're nearly a third of the way through this workout. One more rep. Done. Okay. We're going back to the start and grabbing a drink of water. So straight to press ups. Let's go. Again, if you need to, just drop to your knees. Keeping that body in a nice straight line. Oh, come up. All the way, full press ups, if you can. Nice controlled breathing, so breathing in, breathing out, breathing in, breathing out. That keeps the core nice and strong. Last rep. Done. In the squats. 15 seconds flies by on the rest. Keep your legs moving while you're waiting. Again, shoulder width apart. Chest up, let's go. Down 45 degrees. 
nice and controlled. Straight back, neutral spine. My knees aren't going over my toes. It's like you're gonna sit down into a chair and then stand back up. Can't go full dip, that's fine, you can just do half. That's not a problem. Done. Okay, next exercise into Russian twists. So back down onto the mat. And go. So we're keeping that nice C-shaped spine, rotating around, head up, elbow to knees, trying to get that torso round, those shoulders round as much as we can. Again, if you want to make it harder, you can lean back a little bit further, and then bring your hands down either side, right over here. Nearly there, let's go, come on. Done. Okay. Mountain climbers next. Flying through this session. Well done, everyone. Let's keep it going. So back to that press up position. We've got five seconds. Two, one, let's go. So nice and controlled knees in. Keep those elbows bent. Shoulder blades squeezed in together. Really good for your core, heart, lungs, fitness, get yeah, everything working. Twenty seconds. We're over halfway through this workout now. Let's keep going. Done. Good work. Into those lateral lunges next. Again, just making sure you've got enough room. Just bring that breathing back under control. Keep the legs moving while we're waiting. Two, one, let's go. Down nice and low. Again, aiming for about a 90 degree bend in the leg. So once we're through these lunges, each exercise once more, and then cool down. Doesn't have to be a long workout, it be a good workout. So let's keep pushing. Fifteen to go, come on. Keep that work rate up. Done. Okay, last set. As you can see, heart rate should be up, breathing should be up, a little bit out of breath. Five seconds. Let's get down onto the floor, ready for these press ups. Remember, you can start from your knees if you need to. Elbow back to 45 degrees. Shoulder blade squeezed in. Or we can go to the floor. And I want to get nice and low, as low as I can. If I can't, do a smaller movement through the half press up, a smaller movement through the full press up. Go all the way down, all the way up. We've got 20 seconds to go. Let's keep working hard. See how many more reps we can get in. Don't rush too much. Just want to keep it controlled. 10 seconds. So we're going to keep going all the way to the beat. Done. Good work. Back into the squats. Again, shoulder width apart with the feet. Back straight, chest up. Five, two, one, let's go. And down 90 degrees, neutral spine, straight back, chest up. Up. 
my knees, staying over my feet, do not go out past my toes. My hips are going back, drive out through my glutes on the way up. Bring your arms in to work a little bit as well if you want. 15 seconds. Let's keep going. Nearly there. Just over three minutes of this workout left. Let's go. Done. Brush and twists. Back down onto the mat. Quick break. Two, one, let's go. Elbow to knee. Try and keep that head up. C shaped spine. Start getting a little bit warm now, that spine just means you're working. Let's keep going. Fifteen seconds, control that breathing. Five. Down. Mountain climbers next. Okay. Back into that press up position. Those arms might be getting slightly sore. You need to shake them out, shake them out. Try and go the whole way through though if you can. Ready, let's go. So again, nice and control. We're not rushing this, we're not doing it for speed. Nice, steady pace. Keep those abs working, keep that back flat if you can. Knees in. Come on, we need you there now. Let's keep going. 10 seconds. Come on. Two, one, done. Oh, get really warm. This is good. Let's keep pushing. One last exercise during that lateral lunge. So make sure you've got room. Two, one, let's go. So you're going down. 90 degree bend in the knee. If you can. Not too much what you do with your arms. You can bring them in a little bit of work, or you can just keep them across your body. Last 20 seconds. Let's go, come on. Just speed it up. Last little bit, 10 to go, come on. All the way to the beat. Done. Great work, everyone. Good work. Hopefully, you're a little bit out of breath like me. You've worked hard, feel like you've worked hard. So we just need to make sure we do a cool down, otherwise we're gonna really feel it tomorrow. So just nicely, just walking on the spot, or if you've got room, you can just move around, walk around, and we're just gonna shake those arms out. Just keep everything nice and loose. And then we're gonna run through a quick stretch down, working top to bottom, if you need to take a little bit longer, take your time, that's fine. But we want to get it done quickly today. So first one, hand down the middle of your back. Chin up, abs in tight. Stretch out those triceps. About 10 seconds for this stretch. Take it out, swap sides, down the middle of the back. Get that chin up. We're going to move on to the upper back. We're going to bring the arms out forwards. I'm going to dip my chin down into my chest. I'm going to keep my feet moving a little bit while I'm doing this. Just 
Feel those back muscles stretch out. And then shake that out as well. Okay, moving on to the chest. Both hands, lower back, shoulders back, lift up. So I'm just pushing my hands away. So especially after the press ups and mountain climbers, our pectoral muscles, our chest muscles might be a bit sore. We need to stretch those out. Okay, shake that out. Feel the arms a little bit, loosen up. Moving on to the legs, quads first. Do one right up the front, grab your laces, knees together. Try and keep your balance. You can always hold onto a wall if you've got one. But it's a good chance just to work on that stability. Good, swap sides. Wobble a bit more on this side. So abs in tight, hips forward, knees together. Good. Okay, a couple more stretches left. Hamstrings. So front leg straight, back leg bent. Just stretch it out down the back of the legs. Bring your toes up if you want. Make it a little bit tougher. This one, some of you might want to hold for a little bit longer. That's absolutely fine. Swap sides. Hopefully, your heart rate, your breathing is starting to come down now. You might start to cool down a little bit. Good. Bunch of calves. Nice straight line from your ankle all the way up. Support the weight in the front leg if you need to. Okay, we're actually we're going to do one more stretch after this, just to make sure our lower backs are nice and relaxed. So we're just going to finish stretching out on the floor. Just gonna roll my knee across my body. Stretch out the lower back, stretch out my glutes. Welcome everyone, hope you enjoyed that workout, hope you found it tough. Make sure you check out some of the other workouts that London Ufrain have got up online and hopefully we'll see you all at an event soon.